I'll read the following scenario and answer the two questions that follow, grouped questions, interesting questions. 41 applicants have been shortlisted for interviews for some data analyst positions. Some of the applicants have advanced expertise in one or more fields among the following, data analysis, database handling and coding. The numbers of applicants with different advanced expertise are given in the 2 by 8 table given below. So 2 rows and 8 columns, database, database analysis, database handling, data analysis, database handling, coding. Data analysis and database handling, database handling and coding, data analysis and coding, all three. The number of applicants with advanced expertise in all three fields is given as X in the table, where X is a non-negative in integer. First of all, I was a little worried about this. Whenever I'm given this kind of, this question screams set theory. I always worry whether the person who's created this question has meant data analysis only or data analysis. My bias is for taking it as data analysis, but I just worry. Are they thinking the same way that I'm thinking? And so I think that got eased out. The best, what best can be concluded about the value of X? If it were my other way of thinking, data handling is data handling only, then X can be anything. That's not the case. And so, so now is a classic Venn diagram question. I'm going to say, hey, let's put our three circles, put everything in. Data analysis, database handling, and coding. And so I think it's database handling. Yeah, database handling. I wonder what that means. 12, 5, 7. This is 12. This is 5. This is 7. This is X. All three is X. And so database, um, data analysis and database handling is 2. Analysis and database handling is 2. So this is 2 minus X. Database handling and coding is 3. Database handling and coding is 3. So this is 3 minus x. The whole thing is 3. So this is 3 minus x. I'm just putting this in. I can use that formula A union B union C is A plus B plus C minus A intersection B minus B intersection C minus C intersection A plus A intersection B intersection C. But I like doing this because I can stick everything with one because only, only one missing number, right? X. This is the other one. Data analysis and coding is 6. Data analysis and coding is 6. So this is 6 minus x. Right, so 2, 3, 6, data analysis and database handling is 2, 2 minus x, 3, 3 minus x, 6, 6 minus x. Right. Now I can fill everything else up. So I add these two to 6, 6 plus 2 minus x is 8 minus x, so x plus 4. This is 5 totally, this is these two. These two add up to 3, 5 minus x, add x, we'll get that. Totally 7, 6 minus x plus x is 6, this is 9 minus x, I have to go to 7, x minus 2. 9 minus x plus x minus 2, the x goes off, x minus 2 will take us to 7. I'm adding these 4 to add up to 7, these 4 to add up to 5, these 4 to add up to 12. Right, so what best can be concluded about the value of x? We have x here. We know all of these should be non-negative integers. They can be 0, but they cannot be minus 1. So this is 2 minus x sitting here. 2 minus x is greater than or equal to 0. That means x is 0, 1 or 2. x cannot be negative because there's an x sitting here. An x sitting here. And there's an x minus 2 sitting here. There is 2 minus x and x minus 2. Very interesting. 2 minus x should exist. x minus 2 should exist. Both can't be negative or both should be 0. Oopsie. Quite beautifully, we know that x minus 2 equal to 2 minus x equal to 0 or x is 2. So what best can be concluded about the value of x? x is 2 only. Only 2 is possible, nothing else is possible. If it were 3, this will become negative. If it were 1, this will become negative. Done. True. Beautiful question because you put everything in, then x minus 2 should exist, 2 minus x should exist. It exists as in both should be non-negative. X minus 2 and 2 minus X are not negative or X should be 0, it should, both should go to 0. It should be 2, both should go to 0. Nice. How many applicants did not have advanced expertise in any of the three given fields? Did not have. Totally there are 41 applicants. How many did not have? And so I need to add everything up. This whole bunch adds up to 12. 3 minus X plus X is 3. 12 plus 3, 15. 15 plus X plus minus 2, 15 plus x minus 2, x is 2, x minus 2 is 0, this is 15. The whole union is 15, totally there are 41 people. 
So outside should be 41 minus 15, just 26 people. Look at the choices. Hopefully 26 is there as one of the choices.